Life is a journey filled with ups and downs, where finding motivation and inspiration becomes essential. For those who have faith in Jesus Christ and God, this quest is deeply rooted in their spiritual beliefs. Together, motivated by faith in Jesus and God, these forces create a fulfilling life, guiding us through life's twists and turns, leading us towards self-discovery and growth. In the video ahead, we'll explore how faith-based motivation and inspiration can be cultivated, from discovering purpose to nurturing resilience. Join us on this faith-filled journey, as we unlock the secrets to a life filled with motivation and inspiration, all under the loving guidance of Jesus and God. With faith as our compass, we embark on a transformative quest, making dreams a reality under their loving care. Proverbs 3 verse 26 For the Lord will be at your side and will keep your foot from being snared. Psalm 56 verses 3 to 4 When I am afraid, I put my trust in you. In God, whose word I praise in God, I trust and am not afraid. What can mere mortals do to me? 2 Corinthians 5 verse 7 For we live by faith, not by sight. Psalm 27 verse 3 Though an army besiege me, my heart will not fear. Though war break out against me, even then I will be confident. Isaiah 41 verse 10 So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Romans 8 verse 31 What, then, shall we say in response to these things? If God is for us, who can be against us? Psalm 118 verse 6 The Lord is with me. I will not be afraid. What can mere mortals do to me? Hebrews 4 verse 16 Let us then approach God's throne of grace with confidence, so that we may receive mercy and find grace to help us in our time of need. Proverbs 28 verse 1 The wicked flee though no one pursues, but the righteous are as bold as a lion. Philippians 4 verse 13 I can do all this through him who gives me strength. Psalm 118 verse 8 It is better to take refuge in the Lord than to trust in humans. Hebrews 10 verse 35 So do not throw away your confidence. It will be richly rewarded. Psalm 71 verse 5 For you have been my hope. Sovereign Lord, my confidence since my youth. Ephesians 3 verse 12 In him and through faith in him we may approach God with freedom and confidence. 1 John 5 verse 14 This is the confidence we have in approaching God, that if we ask anything according to his will, he hears us. Psalm 20 verse 7 Some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we trust in the name of the Lord our God. 1 John 4 verse 18 There is no fear in love, but perfect love drives out fear because fear has to do with punishment. The one who fears is not made perfect in love, Proverbs 14 verse 26 Whoever fears the Lord has a secure fortress, and for their children it will be a refuge. Romans 8 verses 38 to 39 For I am convinced that neither death nor life, either angels nor demons, either the present nor the future, nor any powers, either height nor depth, nor anything else in all creation will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. Psalm 112 verse 7 They will have no fear of bad news. Their hearts are steadfast, trusting in the Lord. 
Philippians 1 verse 6. Being confident of this, that he who began a good work in you will carry it on to completion until the day of Christ Jesus. Psalm 23 verse 4. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. 2 Timothy 1 verse 7 For the Spirit God gave us does not make us timid, but gives us power, love, and self-discipline. Psalm 27 verse 1 The Lord is my light and my salvation, whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life, of whom shall I be afraid? Isaiah 12 verse 2 Surely God is my salvation. I will trust and not be afraid. The Lord, the Lord himself, is my strength and my defense. He has become my salvation. Proverbs 3 verses 25 to 26. Have no fear of sudden disaster or of the ruin that overtakes the wicked. For the Lord will be at your side and will keep your foot from being snared. 1 Corinthians 16 verse 14 Do everything in love. Psalm 56 verse 3 When I am afraid, I put my trust in you. Romans 15 verse 13 May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Proverbs 21 verse 31 The horse is made ready for the day of battle, but victory rests with the Lord. Romans 12 verse 12 Be joyful in hope, patient in affliction, faithful in prayer. Isaiah 54 verse 17 no weapon forged against you will prevail, and you will refute every tongue that accuses you. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and this is their vindication from me, declares the Lord. 2 Corinthians 3 verses 4 to 5 Such confidence we have through Christ before God. Not that we are competent in ourselves to claim anything for ourselves, but our competence comes from God. Psalm 33 verses 18 to 19 But the eyes of the Lord are on those who fear him, on those whose hope is in his unfailing love, to deliver them from death and keep them alive in famine. Hebrews 11 verse 1 now faith is confidence in what we hope for and assurance about what we do not see. 1 Peter 3 verses 13 to 14 Who is going to harm you if you are eager to do good? But even if you should suffer for what is right, you are blessed. Do not fear their threats. Do not be frightened. Psalm 31 verse 24 be strong and take heart, all you who hope in the Lord. Hebrews 10 verse 19 Therefore, brothers and sisters, since we have confidence to enter the most holy place by the blood of Jesus. Romans 5 verse 5 And hope does not put us to shame, because God's love has been poured out into our hearts through the Holy Spirit who has been given to us. Psalm 118 verse 5 When hard pressed, I cried to the Lord. He brought me into a spacious place. Hebrews 3 verse 6 But Christ is faithful as the Son over God's house. And we are his house, if indeed we hold firmly to our confidence and the hope in which we glory. Psalm 27 verse 14 Wait for the Lord. Be strong and take heart and wait for the Lord. Hebrews 6 verse 19 
We have this hope as an anchor for the soul, firm and secure. It enters the inner sanctuary behind the curtain. Psalm 33 verse 22 May your unfailing love be with us, Lord, even as we put our hope in you. 1 John 2 verse 28 And now, dear children, continue in him, so that when he appears we may be confident and unashamed before him at his coming. Psalm 42 verse 11 Why, my soul, are you downcast? Why so disturbed within me? Put your hope in God, for I will yet praise him, my Savior and my God. Romans 8 verses 24 to 25 For in this hope we were saved. But hope that is seen is no hope at all. Who hopes for what they already have? But if we hope for what we do not yet have, we wait for it patiently. Psalm 130 verse 5 I wait for the Lord, my whole being waits, and in his word I put my hope. 2 Corinthians 3 verse 12 Therefore, since we have such a hope, we are very bold. Psalm 119 verse 116 Sustain me, my God, according to your promise, and I will live. Do not let my hopes be dashed. 1 Peter 1 verse 3 Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. In his great mercy, he has given us new birth into a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. Psalm 71 verse 14 As for me, I will always have hope. I will praise you more and more. Romans 15 verse 4 For everything that was written in the past was written to teach us so that through the endurance taught in the scriptures and the encouragement they provide, we might have hope. Psalm 33 verse 20 We wait in hope for the Lord. He is our help and our shield. Titus 2 verse 13 While we wait for the blessed hope the appearing of the glory of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ. Isaiah 26 verse 3 You will keep in perfect peace those whose minds are steadfast because they trust in you. Psalm 34 verse 4 I sought the Lord, and he answered me. He delivered me from all my fears. 1 Timothy 6 verse 17 Command those who are rich in this present world not to be arrogant nor to put their hope in wealth, which is so uncertain, but to put their hope in God, who richly provides us with everything for our enjoyment. Romans 5 verses 1 to 5 Therefore, since we have been justified through faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ, through whom we have gained access by faith into this grace in which we now stand. And we boast in the hope of the glory of God. Not only so, but we also glory in our sufferings, because we know that suffering produces perseverance, perseverance, character, and character, hope. And hope does not put us to shame because God's love has been poured out into our hearts through the Holy Spirit, who has been given to us. Psalm 119 verse 81 My soul faints with longing for your salvation, but I have put my hope in your word.